In the last episode, we talked about autofeed. This is where you have COPD or asthma, where the air gets in, but that air can't get out. You're gonna fix auto peep by adjusting the I to E ratio. What you'd like to do is decrease the amount of inspiratory time or increase the amount of expiratory time or both. By doing this, you're going to allow that breath to get out at the end of expiration. There's three ways that we can fix this problem. The first is by decreasing the eye time. By decreasing the eye time, we are getting that breath into the patient much faster. And by decreasing the eye time, by default, we're increasing the E time. The second way that we can do this is by decreasing the respiratory rate. By decreasing the respiratory rate, we are allowing more time for expiration to happen. And this is probably the most practical way of fixing your patient. The last way you're gonna do this is by decreasing the tidal volume. The less air you put in, the easier it is to get that air out. You might be saying that's gonna to lead to increases in CO2. Well, that's to be expected because we're gonna tolerate something called permissive hypercapnia. We're allowing this to happen so that we can ventilate our patients better and avoid the hemodynamic consequences that auto-peeping causes.